What's going on guys, Wagyu here and I'm back with another video and I'm going to be showing you guys how to create your own mods with little or no coding experience. So this this script, mod P script, was created by Tree BL, Tree BL, yep. And what pretty much what it does is it lets you create a script online on his website and it lets you download it to your device and it's a script that runs on runtime while the game is running. So it's like installing a mod while the game is running so it, that's pretty cool so I'm gonna show you guys how to create your own mods and how to install this so let's go ahead and get started first thing you're gonna have to do is download it to download it just go ahead and tap on the down link right there which is in the thread I'll have the thread link in the description below then just download it and go to where you download it in iFile and you're gonna have to unzip it so just unzip it and then tap done and you can go ahead and delete the zip file and the readme.txt since you won't be needing those and go ahead and uh, copy or cut those two files those are important cut them and go all the way back and go ahead and go into library scroll down a bit mobile substrate dynamic libraries and go ahead and paste it into there also make sure minecraft pog edition is closed from the multitasking and go ahead and switch to minecraft back to minecraft pog edition and you'll see a new button with the menu that says please enter the script id this menu is very important because this is the way to install the mods. Um, you just need to put the script ID, which I'll get to later. So now to make the mods. So it's pretty easy to make mods since you don't need a lot of knowledge. You can go ahead and just tap on a link in the same thread. Then you will be directed to this page. You can either load a script or create a script. So I just tap to create a script. And from there, you can just go ahead and create your own script. So we're just going to go back. And I'm going to show you guys around the thread. So you guys can check it out for yourself as well. I have the link in the description below. So you got the readme, which tells you like the instructions on how to install it and all that good stuff. Then you have the built-in functions, which these functions you can use in your scripts. Um, hopefully he'll add more later. And then he gives you example scripts for you guys to, you know, just try it out. Examples, just put them into your copy and paste it and put it in your script. And there you go. You guys can try them out right there. So... I went ahead and created a quick script just to show you guys how this works. So as you can see, the, the code is right there. If you guys want to try it out, copy it. Um, I really don't care, but anyways, the code is right there. Just tap save, and you'll see your script ID at the top. Then you're going to have to enter that ID right there, and then just tap get script. Then I'm going to go ahead and load up a world, just really quick, creative world. And you can also do this in-game. You don't have to back out and go back in every time. So I'm going to just show you guys what my script does. Pretty much what my script does is when you hit a mob or an animal with TNT, a message is going to pop up like about now. So as you can see, that's what pretty much happens um, when you hit a mob with TNT. Any other block won't do nothing. It just works with TNT. It places lava and it teleports you up in the air. So that's really just really what mine does. It was a, just something quick I made for you to show you guys how this works and, and how it pretty much looks in Minecraft. So that's really it for this tutorial, you guys. If you guys liked it, then just let me know. Let me know if you guys want to see some more tutorials of like scripts, how to make some scripts, you know, just, just let me know. So thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace, guys.